Hi, my name is Dr. Harpreet Nagra. I'm the head of clinical oversight at Supportive. And my colleagues and I recently published a study titled The Role of Synchronous, Moderated, and Anonymous Peer Support Chats on Reducing Momentary Loneliness in Older Adults, a retrospective observational study. And we published in the Journal of Formative Research. In our paper, we assess the impact of anonymous chat-based peer support on momentary loneliness and optimism among older adults ages 65 plus. We had participants answer the prompt, what's your struggle, and then match them to chat groups based on their responses. Trained moderators facilitated the chats, ensuring a safe and supportive environment. The emotional changes were then quantified using a public natural language processing model, GPT-4, to analyze the user messages. What we observed was a significant drop in loneliness during the chat, which was accompanied by a significant increase in optimism. The small group plus moderator conversations exhibited a faster and more pronounced decline, decline in loneliness and uh, increase in optimism compared to the moderator only groups. The top three struggles included physical health or medical issues, followed by social connection and loneliness. We chose to submit our research to JMIR publications for a multitude of reasons. One was the topical fit. Our paper's topic was directly aligned with the journal's intent and purpose um, overall. So we know from um, our previous papers that JMIR formative research has published that um, the journal often publishes uh, papers that are uh, novel and innovative and at the forefront of academic work within digital health especially. We also wanted to make sure that the um, paper was going to the right audience. So for example, we know that Medicare plans that address the well-being of seniors and who are seeking cost-effective means of positively impacting senior population health turn to JMIR publications for the latest innovative work of evidence-based um, programs that can serve to this uh, to the needs that they have. So for this reason um, and for the topical fit, we chose to work with JMIR publications.